Go to media, the uh, radio, Facebook. We're so glad that you are present with us as well. Uh, we, uh, first of all, I want to ask for your prayers for Ruth Ann Bettison, who is Sarah Brandstetter's mom. She's uh, at the emergency room right now, but we want to uh, be thinking about her and praying for her and the family. Also, I want to remind you that during the closing hymn, during the closing hymn, I will ask those of you who have filled out your ministry opportunity com uh, commitment form to come forward during the closing hymn, and I will remind you, and to put that, fold that and put it into the what we call the Joash box. It's a tradition of our church on Commitment Sunday. So hopefully you have read through that and thought about how you would like to be involved or re-involved in the church's ministry. So that will happen during the singing of the last hymn. Also, uh, we are losing a very vital member of our church, a young man that has made so much, uh, has helped us so much and made a great contribution to the ministry of our church over the last several years. Uh, Jordan Brooks is leaving, uh, going down to Florida, and so uh, we want to wish him the very best. And to that end, I'm going to ask Mandy if she would come up here and make a little presentation. chapter in his life now. Uh, so we are also going to uh, be blessed with a baptism today. Uh, Vicki DeVore is being rebaptized, and so we are so pleased that to be able and privileged to be able to do that. Um, so having said that, we have some other announcements that need to be made, and then we will focus our hearts on worshiping our Lord. Next week is our volunteer luncheon for Touch a Truck. So if you would like to volunteer or pray for the event, please come down and enjoy soup and salad next Sunday right after church. And also, uh, we want to purchase these books for one per family. They're pretty expensive. I found them last year, but they were $7.99 a book. This year, I think I can get grouped down to $5.50, so one per family. But if you would like to sponsor some of these books, um, please use the envelopes in your pew, and that would be great. And um, also, we will have, Gina is having uh, a way of volunteering this, this year that's different, and we'll explain that next Sunday as well. Thank you. Good morning, church family. So I have good news. Youth group is starting back up. <laughs> so if you know a kid from 6th to 12th grade, feel free to send them our way because they're always welcome. We meet from 6 to 8 on Sundays, and honestly, it's just such an amazing time, and it's such an amazing experience to go to. It has helped all my friends and me grow in ways that we couldn't have done without all the help. So if you know anyone, please send them our way. As I just said, they're always welcome. Thank you, and have a good day. 